hi guys and welcome back to my channel and in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys what i eat in a day so most of you already know that we are plant-based eaters um our diet's basically vegan the only thing that makes it not vegan is the fact that we occasionally eat honey so that's from my animals so we're not considered vegans but you know we're plant-based eaters yeah so my family and i have decided that we wanted to incorporate a lot more fruits and vegetables inside of our diet And that has been amazing we've been feeling great and I lost you know like two pounds since trying to do all of this good stuff and eating right and you know eating healthy so um in this video you're gonna see a lot a lot a lot of vegetables being used and that's because of the decision that we've made to you know eat a more how you how would you say like a whole food plant-based diet um the first thing that i'm going to be eating today well not really eating but drinking the first thing i'm going to be drinking yes baby yeah <laughs> the first thing that i'm going to be drinking is a green i was going to say smoothie but no i'm going to be drinking a green juice that i made yesterday because juice yeah <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna be um, drinking a green juice that me and my husband made last night to start off my day. So that's the first thing that we're gonna consume. This All right, so right here, guys, is the juice that Kevin and, Kevin's and I made yesterday. This is 32 ounces of green juice, but I am not going to drink all of this. Yes, baby. Yeah, you want some more? Um, I'm not gonna drink all of it. I'm gonna drink like half of it and then save the other half for tomorrow. Tomorrow. Why are you talking in my video? Send up, baby. Send up. All right. So right now I'm going to make a sorbet. Is it what they call it? A sorbet for um for my breakfast. I'm gonna show you guys how I prepare that, and I have my handy dandy helper right here that is so excited to help us make our breakfast. She can't wait. So right here we have two cups of frozen strawberries and two cups of frozen blueberries. You ready? You ready? Yeah, let's go. You wanna help mommy? Put the strawberries in. Let me drop it in. You wanna do that for mommy? Alright, so now that we're finished with, let me see if you guys can see it. Now that we're finished with our sorbet, I am going to mix in some yogurt inside of it and top it off with a few toppings that I'm going to go ahead and show to you Okay guys, so now we're finished with the sorbet and I know it looks a lot less than what you saw me made. That's because, you know, the husband wanted some, the toddler wanted some, so I had to end up sharing. Why are you putting your balls in my stuff? I have to end up, Kristen, I know you didn't just rub your spoon on me. Eat it. So um, now I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I put as a topping. Yes, Kristen? Eat. Yummy. Okay, so last night I made some granola. So I'm gonna go ahead and top off my sorbet with some granola and unsweetened coconut. Juice. Okay guys, I'm back and it's lunchtime. So right now I am sipping on some Roma. If you watch my 
last video you you would have heard me talk about this drink before it looks like coffee tastes like coffee but it's not coffee I really really like the taste of it um, I don't drink caffeinated beverages or anything like that so um as I was saying it's lunchtime now and oh let me I'm trying to position this right camera right okay so um it's lunchtime now and um, there is one ingredient that I need that is missing and I'm gonna run on the road to do some errands and I'm gonna go pick up that ingredient but for today's lunch I'm gonna be having some summer rolls yeah some summer rolls or spring rolls whatever it is that you want to call them so um, I'm just gonna basically show you guys what I'm prepping right now to um, prepare for my lunch okay so I know that this is not the best angle but you know it's where the light is at so I'm just gonna show you guys what's going on here so for lunch um, I'm preparing spring rolls as I said before and right here I have some tofu extra like I think it's called super from tofu that I have minced that not minced cut up in some strips and I'm soaking them in a marinade that I will link the recipe for down below and then I'm gonna put them on some parchment paper and um, put them in the oven and get them all nice and crisp and add them to my summer roll. Okay, so it's lunchtime, and I'm gonna be making a vegetable spring roll, summer roll. I think that's what people call it. Um, normally, people would use the white ones, and in the past when I've made this before, I've used the white wraps, but when I went to Whole Foods, they didn't have any, they only had the brown rice one which is perfectly fine I don't know how it tastes I know how the white one tastes but I don't know how this one tastes I don't think the taste is gonna be quite different I know you could hear some music playing in the background that's Kristen watching something on YouTube but yeah so I have my rice wrap I have a bowl of warm water on the table here that is going to help um, soften up the wraps over here are the ingredients that we're gonna use to fill up the rice wraps we have tofu we have um, avocados carrots bell peppers purple cabbage and um cilantro so um after i'm finished um wrapping a wrap our veggie wrap then i'm going to go ahead and make a peanut sauce to dip my veggie wraps in so it's kind of like a big asian type of salad and it's really really good and yeah let's, let's go let's make those mint wraps Okay guys, so it's dinner time and here concludes Ooh, our Kristen, babe. Come. She's trying to pick out the cheese out of my burger. Come. But um, here concludes our video, it's dinner time. I was gonna make a bomb spinach and pesto pasta for dinner, but Kevin's wanted burgers instead, so I was like, shoot. It's gonna be easier. Oh, something on my teeth. It's gonna be easier to just make these burgers so and I could go rest earlier than trying to make pot pesto from scratch. So we just decided to go for some burgers. Not the healthiest choice, but it's vegan. <laughs> um, and after we finish with our, well, when I'm finished with my burger, I'm going to go ahead and have this vegan vanilla gluten-free cake that I got from Whole Foods. It's so good. I really like the lemon ones that they have. They have a lemon cake, but they, they didn't have any when I went today. They only had the vanilla. It was so good. So um, here ends our video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.